2019 in Jefferson in, in Louisville. Um, how does the uh, Kentucky Derby help real estate? In, you know, do you can do the best rep, my five favorite restaurants in Louisville. Okay. Okay. Hi there. You know, my, um, you know, hi there. Uh, my name is Rodney Evans. Um, a local rest, uh, local realtor. But what I really love about my hometown, Louisville, is the great restaurants. We have barbecue, we have Italian, we have everything here. We uh, we have good old Southern cooking here. Um, and these are some of my favorite places. And I want to, you know, also, by the way, if you're looking to move here, because I love this area, it's just a great climate, nice people, good appreciation. Give me a call. Maybe I can help you answer any questions for you. Be very non-commercial, be very open and talk about restaurants, talk about school districts, talk about mistakes okay. people make, how to how to apply for a mortgage in, in Kentucky. Um, try to make it so somebody today, mm -hmm. reverse engineering it again. Okay. Someone in Louisville <clears throat> is going to type in how to buy a home or where to find a home or homes for sale or how to qualify for a mortgage or anything you can think of. And they're going to put that right now, if we went into Google and said mm -hmm. buying a home in Louisville, what are we going to see? A lot of like contact for realtors. A lot of realtors, okay. And realtor sites are really, sh they're really shit. They're they very commercial. <laughs> they are. They're boring. They're commercial. They, they got pop up banners and yeah. they're all complicated in tags. And I am a realtor with uh, Keller Williams and we're wonderful mm. and everything like that. Oh, yawn. <laughs> you know? <laughs> What, what would you like? First time home buyer. You don't know anybody. You're, you're looking for someone who's just that you can trust. <clears throat> right. So you want to carve out that niche of people who say, hey, I just saw Mr. And they call you up, say hello as a realtor. Go ahead. Hello. You know, sound like a realtor, like a business call. Ring, oh. ring. Hello, this is uh, Rodney with Keller Williams. I'm going to help you. Yeah, Rodney, I oh, you do answer your phone. Man, I just saw your video. <laughs> great, great. Y you know, really nice video. That Louisville looks great. I want to go to that one restaurant you talked about, man. That, that barbecue place looks fantastic. Well, good, good. How can I help you? You know, my mom, um, I'm up here in uh, New York, and my mom lives in Louisville, and um, she needs to sell her home. And I don't know anybody down there. And I was just going through the Google and, and stuff. And something about your video resonated with me. And I okay. thought I'd give you a call. Maybe you could, maybe we could talk about it. Maybe you could help my mom. Well, I'm glad you did. Uh, what, what, uh, what is it that your mom's looking to do with the house? Okay. You said you're glad you did, which is good. Give me a little bit more. Give me a cookie here. Give me a, okay. give me a stroke. Okay. This is I'm what glad. it's all. See, you got to make me feel okay. I okay. took the and I called you up. I like your videos. I, I said this is really I liked what you said and everything like that. Now you got to give it back to me so we're even, adult to adult, not okay. parent to child here. Okay. You got to make you got to I just gave I just said something nice to you. Now you got to come up to me and say something nice to me. Okay. This is how we get to bonding and likability and trust and all this good stuff. Okay. I want to make so when you get off the <clears throat> phone you are the man who's going to sell mom's $500,000 property. Okay. How do you make this man fall in love with you? Just called you out of nowhere. It's a warm call. You want to stay away from no presentation, no begging for the order. What I want you to stroke, nurture, empathy. Three important words. Stroke is a sincere compliment. Thank you for calling. Really appreciate it. You know, it's nice. Okay. Then nurture. You know, Mr. Evans, I think that's so great you're taking care of your mom like that. I really like hearing about uh, sons who take care of their mom. You don't hear that very often today. Uh, you're, you're a good son. I really appreciate that. Anything I can do to help you and your mom? How old's your mom? Okay. You know, boom, like that. What am I doing here? Uh, stroking, nurturing. Okay, nurture. Bill. Mom. We're talking about <coughs> taking care mom. of your mom. I'm telling right. you, calling him a good son. Yeah. And everything like that. What am I doing here? What's the psychology of what I'm doing here? Uh, reciprocity. Reciprocity. Also, am I getting you to like me by uh -huh. stroking and nurturing you? What are you thinking about? If I do it right, I sound sincere. I'm an actor, but I'm uh -huh. also using a lot of psychology here. People <clears throat> do uh -huh. business with people they like and trust. Like, right, right. 
Whereas your competition, what are they going to sound like? What are they going to do? Uh, talk and immediately try to set up an uh, appointment. Yep, right away, right away. Just give me, give me, give me. Let me tell you how wonderful. We're Keller Williams. We've been in business and we got offices everywhere. And see, that doesn't resonate with him. That's right. in, that's up here. That's intellectual. Mm -hmm. I want you to down here because the million dollar rule. What's what's the million dollar rule again? Uh oh. Don't tell me. The most important thing I teach. I'll only make you, it'll make you rich, man. It'll make you rich if you understand this rule. Oh, people important. people buy on emotion, not uh, not logic. They they substantiate the emotion later on with, with logic. With, yeah, the yeah. logic comes in later because mm -hmm. it's got to make sense. Otherwise, you're mm -hmm. going to get that. Um, you're going to get that um, <clears throat> where they uh, get out of the deal. They don't want to do the deal later. Oh, I thought about it and everything. You know, they make the decision quick. Emotionally, they substantiate it intellectually. Mm -hmm. Makes a lot of sense. But you want them to feel so good about you that you've overcome the stranger thing. Okay. Um, on there. So I'm sorry to jump all over you there. No, no, no. That's the, good. This, this is the stuff that can, in one phone call, you can get the contract. Yeah. Just like that. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So let's go back. Do it again. Remember, give me a stroke. Give me a nurture. Yeah, my mom, I'm in New York. Uh, my mom's down there. She's uh, 93 years old. Um, she's going to move in with a good friend of ours and I need somebody down there to help sell her home. And I was, I was just going through Google and YouTube. And I saw your video. I thought I'd give you, and you answered your phone. I really like that. Oh, thank you. I really do appreciate that. And you, uh, you're to be commended for, uh, taking care of your mom like that. That's a, uh, that's a very good thing. Not, you don't hear that too often nowadays about sons taking care of their moms, particularly with the distance between you. See how beautiful that sounds? See the difference? Yeah. Do you see? I mean, really, do you see it? The, this, uh -huh. this, it's 180 degrees different. You just made rewarded him. You made him feel good. Okay. You made okay. him.